Hi everyone, welcome to this week's Sunday face mask. So have I got a surprise for you. This is the most excited I've been for a face mask in a very long time and in case you didn't know what it was, Pixie have took us all by storm and brought out two sheet masks. I cannot wait to try these out. I don't know which one I'm going to be trying out but basically they've took us all by storm and they've brought out two masks. One's a plump collagen boost mask and one's a glow glycolic mask so both completely different but oh my god i just don't know which one to pick up and i'm just so excited to try them i've got a feeling they're gonna be so good and you get three in a packet i've actually got them all here and i think they're so affordable as well so which one should we go for let's have a little look i think i'm gonna go with the plump collagen one so it's it's got peptides botanical collagen and omega oils and it says youth infusing sheet mask Directions so oh instantly smoothing and pumping effective sheet mask collagen and peptides help to improve and maintain elasticity promoting firmer healthier looking skin sounds good it also says the best time to use is after cleansing and before moisturizer on bare skin so I'm completely cleansed completely clean I've had my shower so I'm all good pat dry into contours to fit snuggly. Leave on for 10 to 15 minutes, remove mask and pat in excess serum to face, neck and decolletage. So completely normal as always. Oh, it also stays, says store in the fridge for a refreshing and depulping effect. So this will be fabulous in the summer. I love a little cool mask in the summer. Okay, let's just get on with it. Let me just tie my hair back. Bands on. Okay, let's go. So let's see what it looks like. No smell. Okay, so do you have the cheap mask? Let's hope I am plumped. I am a little bit red too. Funny enough, I've just filmed a video, which you'll probably all see anyway, of the Clarins flash bomb. Oh my god, it just broke me. Well, I've been red for a good 40 minutes. I had to re-cleanse my skin and everything, all that, I ended up just getting a shower in the end. But, 40 minutes later I'm still red. So I'm hoping this will do the trick, it'll just calm me down, but, wow, that was an awful product. Awful. Anyway, back to this, so, put all this out. Oh, I've got a feeling these eye holes are going to be huge. It's not as wet as I thought it was going to be, if I'm being completely honest, but... Take it down me now. Like, compared to, like, Garnier and that, they're, like, saturated, but it is still... Moist. I hate that word. <laughs> you just feel so much better after a face mask, like... It just solves all problems. <laughs> Problem, face mask. Straight away, I can notice, and this is not a big, but usually when I put a face mask on, it covers my eyes completely. And this is the same problem I had with Dr. Jart and the eye holes. Like, look at this eye holes down here. So, this straight away, I can tell, is not the same like, average sheet mask. Like, it's just it's not covering me properly. So, oh, big the eye holes are it's like down my face, it's like here. Usually, the eye holes cover the brow the brow bone and go in like a circle or like an oval shape these are like going that way so let's just hope it looks fine anyway but yeah as long as it stays on that doesn't bother me as long as it doesn't start moving around that's completely fine but let's hope we are plumped right let's have a quick look these are what it looks like on the website Instant smoothing plumping effect of sheet mask. So it is soothing straight away. I will say that it is soothing. Um, collagen peptides help to improve and maintain the skin's at least elasticity, promoting firm, healthier looking skin, which it does say on the back of that also. Box contains three and it's £10, which I think is brilliant. How to apply, we know that ingredients. 
there's no actual reviews yet because this is brand new also i was like i need to get it when i seen they were launching it, i was like i need to get it but yeah so there's no reviews so hopefully it's just basically saying that we're gonna have firmer looking skin which is a big claim but i think it's just gonna be like nice and soothing but i will see you all in 15 minutes so i'm back i ended up taking the headbands off because it was annoying me um it's been literally 14 minutes so it's not fit me well straight away the mask but i just hope this is another repeat of dr john <laughs> okay let's have a look I mean, it's, my skin's glowing. I don't know if it's plumped up. I think you'd have to use it like three times a week or so. Yeah, I like it. I mean, it's for the price point, yeah, it is. It's. But I don't love it. I think I would prefer this one much more. I thought I was going to love it, but I mean, it's, it is nice. It is nice on the skin. It's nice and hydrating. I can't say that I've noticed a lot of plumpness, but I think that's going to come with time. I think you have to use quite a few first before you saw a difference, especially in terms of like strength and like elasticity and things like that. That's not something that is going to happen overnight. So yeah, I do like it. I think you would have to use it a few goes though to see like your skin strengthen. If you bought the, pa the actual packet, which you get three in it for £10, and you use it for the week, you might notice a difference. It could then become a little more expensive because you could be spending £10 each week on masks, but I, I have done that in the past. So, so yeah, I do think they're so affordable. I do like it. As I say, I think you'd have to use it quite a few goes, but overall, yeah, I do, I do like it. It's not my absolute favourite mask I've ever tried, but I think for the price point, and I do love Pixie as a whole, so yeah, I would recommend it. Take my hair out. Hmm? We're good, we're good to go. But anyway, I hope you've enjoyed this week's Sunday face mask. Hopefully next week I'll be trying out the Glow Glycolic, so stay around for that. Hope you all have the most amazing, magical, lazy Sunday evening. And I'll see you all in the next video. Bye.